is up, you guys? I just have to say I love today's outfit. Okay, we have our little buddy here. He was just in his sweater. We should put on your sweater again for the camera so everybody can see it. Yeah, and we're gonna have like a full Christmas day. We're gonna go to brunch, we're gonna go shopping. I really wanna go to Winners because I saw something during the fall season that I was like, I think I need that. So we're gonna go get that. And then I have a couple of items of clothing that I wanna purchase. So I love, obviously you guys know I love wearing. There is like just a spot of light that comes right through there. So I wanna get more of these plaid shirts. I always wear them, they're super soft. I don't get like sweaty in them or overheated, but this hat though, it's Love Your Melon. It's like a Mickey Mouse collection, it was a gift. I love it. Okay, I'm not gonna tell you guys what I'm working on. Holiday merch, things are happening. So the tree needs to go up like very, very soon. So I moved some things away. I deep cleaned the carpet, which you guys saw, amazing. And we have progress happening in the backyard. Holiday sweaters are coming out. So let's put Carl's sweater on so you guys can be a part of it. By the way, you can follow Carl on Instagram. This picture will have been posted by now. Do you wanna put your sweater on? I got you treats. You can try, you can try on your sweater and I'll give you more treats that I, that I picked up for you. No, don't run away. No, don't run away, I promise. It's good things. It's good things. It's good things. So it's an easy one. Are you a size 12? A, a puppy? A puppy size 12? I don't even know what that means in dog. This is like a real coat. Like you could go, and we're not gonna say the word, but you could go outside. Oh, well, outside is just as bad as a word. Ah, oh, amazing. Amazing. Hello, everybody. This, there's a little hood on it. It's like a real walking shirt. Um, there's a hole through it to put his his leash and everything You're a real Canadian pup. He's got his winter jacket, too We should totally put on your boots and show people how you walk with your boots on look Mommy and me. Why do you look so miserable? You guys insert Carl's Instagram post here and how happy he was two seconds ago. Maybe he's overheating though mm. Okay, we're gonna go shopping go to brunch try and find some treasures We're gonna get Carl some treats cuz he's being such a Good little boy. Yes, we're listening to our lovely Christmas jazz music. All right, naked baby. Okay, you guys, stay tuned for our full day of Christmas vlogging, shopping, and starting the decorating process. <laughs> Okay, so update, very successful shopping. We hit up Winners, then Home Sense in Canada, home, same as Home Goods, and we just went to Marshalls. I just wanna say though that the gift wrapping situation is quite bleak. There's nothing. Do you think that we're too early? Yes, I do think we're too early. Do you guys think we're too early? 
Like, I don't think, oh, there's a puppy that went to Marshall's living his best life. So I just want to say that we got some pep, what did you get? You got a hot chocolate? Hot chocolate yeah. What did I get? Uh, peppermint. Mochaccino? White chocolate mochaccino, something like that. From Second Cup. Delish. With some candy cane on top. And if you can see the pink bags back there, that's where I get my plaid shirts. And I found one. It was hidden in the store. The girl, don't you love whenever people are like, no, we don't have that. And I'm like, found it. Got it. Mm -hmm. So I got one, but I love these shirts. It's like my go-to and I don't sweat in them. So they're comfy cozy. Okay. So we're going back home to have our lunch. We picked up Subway, which we haven't had Subway in so long. We're going to see how good that goes. What did you say? It's like underwhelming. It's very underwhelming. You have a fluff. Keeping it there for later. So we're gonna go, <laughs> we're gonna go head home and pull the bins out, go visit with Dr. Carl, and enjoy the rest of our Christmas shopping day. That's mine. Okay, you turn around. Why? Okay, it's not yours. This is the, what is wrong with you? You can sit. You can sit next to me, but you're not having any. It's turkey sandwich. Or no, it. Okay, we've got the fireplace going. It is now nighttime. It is dark outside, which means I can show you our Christmas lights. All right, so to go with these lights, we planted, literally planted, a blue spruce back here. Isn't he pretty? So tomorrow we are extending this deck. So the pillar, you can kind of see, see that little dot back there? See the little dot back there? So those are gonna be supporting pillars to build the deck all the way around. So that this way when we get in the hot tub, we can just drag the cover over. But now we have some ambiance outside and we are about to light the entire, here I'll show you, oh my gosh, I said I wasn't gonna go outside, it's freezing. So the back balcony is all going to be lit up as well. So it's gonna be like a beautiful, cozy, backyard situation and in here what we're thinking about doing close the door like once the door is closed it's fine in here we're gonna get a heater i think like an infrared heater to put right up there and then when we're in here we can like light a candle and sit and chill and then right here i just need to measure i think what we're gonna do is get a heated walkway for outside so that the snow can't melt on and also our feet don't freeze so that's the plan but let me show you what we got when we were shopping All right, you can see like all of the home goods bags back here and I'm still finding Halloween decorations in my cupboard. So I'm bringing them down as I'm going. The transition is real from like Halloween to Christmas is the most difficult one because there's so much stuff. There's the most amount of that stuff, but I wanted to get clothes today. So I also placed an order with this company online. I'll link everything for you guys. So I have been doing the 21 day total body shred and I'm about to, this has probably already been divulged by now, so I can probably share it, but first let's make sure our beanie is on straight. I have been going through the 21 day total body shred, but I have been secretly in the job one test group. So the job one test group is probably almost available to you guys, which is insane, 20 minute workouts, but these are perfect for the 21 day total body shred because for most of the workouts, you don't even need shoes, just some nice leg warmers because you know, you kind of feel like a beautiful dancer when you're doing it. Okay, these, let me tell you the full story. I also got, one second. Okay, these socks are the best. I have one other pair and I wear them all the time. They actually have like a fleece lining. So I got one more pair and they're like the cabin style socks. But then they also came in like the buffalo plaid, basically the, the, t the pattern that I have in everything. But then I was at the store and the same, that heat max thing, they come in mittens. So I got buffalo ones and then I got regular black knit, like a cable knit for whenever I'm like, if we're going out to dinner or something. So these would be like my daytime mittens and my evening. It's like pure cold weather fine, but they're necessities. Then I plow slippers, like it's nobody's business. So right now I have my boots on, which look like slippers, but I go through so many slippers because I wear them all day long because I work from home. So. Uh, by the way, I don't even feel like I need to say that anymore because everybody does. Like it was cool two years ago, but I feel like now everybody does. Anyways, so these are like the softest. They have like a little fleece inside and they're like little booties with pom-poms. They're very cute. Best slippers ever. And by the way, the reason I shop at this place, first of all, I've been shopping here since I'm a little, <laughs> so embarrassing. I used to shop here when I was little. I love this store. So it's a Canadian store, but they do ship to the States. So these are were $22, but everything is discounted. Like he everything is heavily discounted all the time. 
Like everything that I'm about to show you, I think I spent a total of 50 bucks. Okay, then there's more. I went to the store specifically looking for this because my husband did the laundry today and shrunk all of my shirts. That has never happened to us before. I do not know what we did, but all of the, all of the shirts got shrunkened and I have long arms. So this is rolled, but the, the other ones, like the other shirts go like this now and they're like, I can't. <laughs> so this is what I was looking for and it's so soft and like they have like the best fabric and this was like probably 20 bucks. Yeah, 24 bucks. And then I thought I'd get it in like a, this is like a cream, what do we call this? It's like country cabin chic. Listen, I get it, okay, I have like one style. I'm not a, st I, I will never be a fashion vlogger, but I do know what works for me. Lululemon leggings, slippers and muckluck boots, fuzzy socks, beanie, plaid shirt. Like, it, you know what, stick to what works, okay. Then we went ham with getting everything that we need for wrapping. And I got a couple of pieces of decor too. So this is how we wrap. The wrapping paper becomes part of our decor. So in the Very Merry collection that I've launched, there is actual custom wrapping paper, which you've probably seen by now. But so we're gonna have touches of that. So there's little magical Disney touches, but I wanted to have like the peppermint look. So this is from Santa with love from Santa all over it. So it's like a letter. So everything is like peppermint themed. And then Andre picked this one, which I think will wrap like the kids gifts in that. So it's like a Santa. I got a bunch of the peppermint ones, but here's the thing. If we're being honest, I'm the one that wraps the gifts. And then if Andre has a gift for me, he doesn't really love the wrapping paper thing. So this is a great tip. If you have littles or a husband that doesn't know how to wrap gifts, the bags are so cool. And you can get these at like Marshall's, Winners, Home Sense, they're awesome. So I love this one. And again, it has like the peppermint finish and you can just fill it with tissue paper and let them go ham with that. So on that note, I got a ton of these big tissue paper collections, which totally match the theme. I got like a peppermint one. If you're new here, you will see the entire house is decorated with like a Candyland Christmas theme. And then I got these bows that you can just like peel and stick, but they're really, again, does this not remind you of Sia's Christmas album? <laughs> so these are super easy. Again, like you don't have to do anything. They're just really pretty. So that is going to stay down here. That is not going upstairs. So it's going to overwhelm me. And then in terms of decor, this I thought was practical yet also decorating friendly. So dish towels, Merry Christmas, and then ho, ho, ho. But I want the one in the middle to go on the bar cart because we always do like a bar cart towelette on the side on the handle so that the other two dish towels, we actually need them. And then I got cocktail napkins. Best place to get cocktail napkins. These are $2. Best place ever is Winners and Home Goods. This is necessary for my peppermint mocha post-workout. Like, I, I don't even feel like I need to explain myself on that. And then this, I think, yeah, this is coming upstairs right now. I need to light this. I needed a balsam candle. And I have not made my way to the mall yet. Oh yes, winter pine, sand and fog, $12.99. I changed the topper on it. Shh, don't tell anybody. Okay, so that's what I got at Winners. So we did Winners, Home Good, Home Sense. I always say, going back and forth between the states, Home Sense is Canadian. So many treasures. Okay, this was also, I think we did the best at Winners. Yes, I definitely think we did the best at Winners. So I saw this tray during like the beginning of fall and I had my eye on it. So I'm pretty sure it's the exact same size as the tray that we have upstairs on the coffee table. But, it, oh, we're seeing a theme. Yeah, yeah. This could be the thumbnail. Like just, she has an obsession, folks. Like, let me just, let me just, let me just, one second, let me just, and the napkins. Oh my gosh, at what point is this? Someone needs to check me into a facility. Oh my, I realize I love plaid, but now it's like, at what point is it ridiculous? I, I love it and it is what it is. Okay, is this not beautiful? And it's like laminated. Oh, and this was, oh my gosh, I don't even know, $34.99. I feel okay about it. All right, more wrapping. So 
Oh, I loved this one. So I got more of those bags, like the gift bag bags. And this is the brand. It's always that same brand, Queen West Trading Co. North Pole Workshop, very cute. And then I got one of these big bows to put on like a bigger gift box. I wasn't loving all the bows. Some of them looked kind of cheap. Oh, these, yes. I was like, that's coming in my shopping cart, right? Pause because there's more. Okay, so that was that was winners. Yeah. Then let's move on to Home Sense. So Home Sense, I feel like you guys are gonna love this. So I think one is gonna be for my parents, and the other one's gonna be for Andre's parents, which they will equally appreciate. So this says alcohol because no one, no great story ever began with a salad. And it's it's literally a bag that holds like it has dividers to have like four bottles in here. I think that's perfect, right? Especially if you're like for a hostess gift. I just figured that was a necessity, <laughs> really. And then the biggest slim pickings was these gift boxes. Usually we go ham with these gift boxes because then we don't really have to wrap anything. Not the case this year. So this was the cutest one I could find because it had peppermint on it. And this, this is the only one I got. And then I got a baby brother of him. So I got more of those ribbons from HomeSense, but like the peppermint one. Okay, so this, this plus this is literally Sia's Christmas album cover and her hair on the album cover. Okay, love her, love the album. This is to make my peppermint mocha coffee in the morning. I'm just gonna toss one of those into my espresso. Oh, another bag. This is from Santa with pom-poms, very cute. And then this is where, okay, so this is the little box. This guy really wrapped our stuff very thoroughly. So this is the baby box of the big box. So we only have two, but I keep them year over year. So I'm sure that there's some in that magical cupboard over there. Okay, so these are our Christmas cards. I get the Christmas cards from HomeSense. So these were, there's 15 cards for $6.99 and then I'm gonna get more in Orlando and that's gonna be for those neighbors. And then napkins for our powder room on the main floor. Okay, then Marshalls. Marshalls was probably the least exciting, but actually necessities. So I needed, okay, didn't, don't like those colors as much. It's fine. So gift tags are not easy to find. So I got these glitter ones, but I didn't know, I didn't want gold and silver, whatever. I wanted just red and green, it's fine. So I got two packs of those. And then I got these ones as well. Okay. And then, oh, I, I know I'm just gonna keep saying necessity, but necessity. So that needed to happen. And then I got a couple of gift bags that I thought would, I don't love the look of gift bags under the tree, but listen, it's fine. I thought these were really cute. Like very vintage Santa-esque. And they have glitter all over them. Cute, right? Okay, so I think that's everything. I'm gonna do some major organizing and cleaning and I'm pulling everything out of there. And I'm gonna put all of the gift wrap stuff into the closet once the decor is out. So I'm gonna take that candle upstairs. I'm gonna make myself some form of a Christmas cocktail, probably a martini, not in this. I'm gonna go find, oh, I'm gonna go find one of my Christmas martini glasses in the special closet and have it on my son of a nutcracker napkin. I hope that you guys enjoyed the vlog. If you guys are liking the vlog style, I know that there are a lot more behind the scenes and more unfiltered, but hopefully you guys like that. It not only makes it easier on me because it's just literally you're coming with me throughout the day, but it's that much more real. So if you guys like this, give this video a thumbs up. Make sure that you are subscribed and hit the bell so that you can get notified for the next video. And I will see you guys later. Bye dudes. Yeah.